Hi, welcome to a new Photoshop tutorial. My name is Costa and today we will create a YouTube thumbnail. First, let's create a new document by pressing on Ctrl plus N. Now make sure the size is the same as mine, 9020 by 1080 pixels. The resolution should be 72 pixels per inch. If all your settings are the same, then click on Create. I already imported all the images we need for this tutorial. Now I will drag them into the new canvas that we just created. Also, I used the pen tool to isolate the subject from the background in order to make this tutorial shorter and easier to follow. Let's create a mask for the background layer. Make sure the layer is selected and click on this button icon. After, go and select the gradient tool. Use your mouse to drag from the top to the bottom. Go and select the second background layer and again create a mask. This time drag from the bottom to the top. Now go to the background layer and double click. Select color overlay and choose the same color as mine if you want to get the same result. Then click OK. Create a new empty layer by clicking on this square icon. Select the brush tool, then press and hold on I. Then click on a darker spot that has a similar color as mine. After, reduce the opacity to 50%. And then go to the blending modes and choose Color Burn. Let's create another empty layer. This time, find a lighter spot and choose the soft light in the blending mode panel. I will bring the last image that we have, it's a texture, it will make the image look older. Make sure the subject is on top of the texture. Reduce the opacity of the texture to 50%. And finally, it's time to add the title. Type the text you want, mine is 9050 war. Now I will scale up the text and change the font to impact. Press Ctrl plus J to duplicate the text. The part where it says War, move it a little bit to the bottom. Then select both layers and create a group. Press Ctrl plus T and rotate the text. To center it, press Ctrl plus A and then click on the center icon. Put the text under the texture. Now select all the layers and transform them into a smart object. Go to Filter, choose Camera Raw Filter and click on Color Grading. Don't move the circle too much to the edge because the colors will become too harsh. Please spend enough time in this panel because it can bring a huge difference into your images. I forgot to add a slight effect to the text, so let's double click on the layer. We need to convert the text layer into a smart object in order to be able to create a clipping mask. Now, create a new empty layer and use the brush tool to paint on some parts of the text. Thank you. 
Because we work in a smart object, we need to save what we just modified. So press once on Ctrl plus S. We can improve many things on this thumbnail, but our file size is over 5 megabytes, which means it's already bigger than what YouTube allows us to use. To make the file smaller, we have to reduce from the quality. Press on Shift, Ctrl, Alt and W, Photoshop will open this panel for us. And all we have to do is to put the quality lower than 